Hi everybody, welcome back. It's your girl, Unknown Goddess. How is everyone doing today? I hope you guys are enjoying your week so far. Tomorrow is Friday. I can't believe it already, y'all. But <clears throat> I must say it's been a very productive week and I hope it was for me. So I hope it was for you guys as well. Even if you didn't get exactly what you were looking for, but you made the effort to make something happen, to search, go after what you were looking for, but it didn't pan out the way you wanted, at least you put the effort in, right? So you know what direction to go now, right? If it didn't work in that way, then you know, okay, let me rearrange some things because I've been doing this all for the past however long um, and it didn't work out the way I expected it to, so let me reroute, okay? Because if you just sit there, without taking action, you're not going to know what steps to take, right? So it still was, you still put the work in. So and I hope that's what you guys did. I hope that's what you guys did. I hope you didn't get frustrated with the situation or with yourself, right? All right. Yeah, make a decision. <laughs> Some of you guys were able to make make a new, you're going to have to take make a new decision here, okay? Um, to reroute or, you know, just rearrange. You don't have to take your eye off the prize, but just find a different way of getting to your goal and making it happen, right? They said there's many ways to skin a cat. So you can find a different way of getting it done. All right, you guys, let's just pull the overall general energy um, for you guys. Um, <clears throat> if you are seeking a personal reading, all that information is down below. You know, find something that's going to give you a peace of mind. Find a solution instead of driving yourself insane. Find something that's going to get, bring you a peace of mind, more clarity, right? Find another resolution, okay? All right. Uh, communicate with your spirit guides. They'll, they'll, they'll show you the way. They'll give you, the, they'll give you a clear path. All right, so yeah, yeah, give you another direction to take action. Feel me? Manifest it. All right. I don't know who is that for. But patience is a virtue. My bracelets. I need some new crystals. And I'm, I'm, my spirit is wanting some new things, you know. All right. Let's see what Mother God. I Mother God. Okay. <laughs> Mother God is Father God has in store for you guys. Just pull some general energy. <clears throat> as I open these realms, protect my aura, my energy. Use me as a vessel. Give me clear, honest messages for those who need to hear it. So mote it be. All right. Let's see. Let's shuffle out this deck, baby. Let's shuffle it out. I keep seeing this plus two right here. Okay. If you're looking for a business partnership, um, if you're looking for someone to team up with, somebody that's stable, somebody that's grounded, somebody that's going to partner up with you, and help you to bring this to whatever idea you have to fruition, okay? Um, and the people that you're trying to build with, it ain't working. Um, Spirit is like, just be a little bit more patient with this seven, okay? You're about to get that download. You're about to get. You're about to find what you're looking for, okay? But I feel like it's through. Um, I feel like you're gonna get this message or with this. You're gonna get a download on which way to go, okay? That's why I said to ask your spirit guides, okay? And they're going to open up that door for you. Okay. All right, y'all. But I, I'm, I'm just feeling success here. I'm feeling success here, my collective. You're going to receive the knowledge that you need. You just need to reassess over some things. Okay. All right. So let's see. Ooh, let's pull this table a little closer. Split this deck. Thank you guys again for your love and support for my channel. I really, truly appreciate you guys. You guys are awesome. Okay, thank you for your likes. Thank you for your comments and your subscription. Your subscribes. I said subscriptions. <laughs> there go that seven again. There go that seven. Uh, this seven for me is where your spiritual connection. It's all about spiritual connection. It's all about self-expression. Um, it also can represent your material and domestic achievements have been met. Um, I feel like what you already asked for, what you are manifesting, what you've already invested in, um, it's out there in the ethers already. It's already created. It's just to be a little bit more patient. 
uh, because it is coming in with the chariot energy. It is coming in because somebody is here to determine to be successful. OK, the seven in numerology represents the chariot. And so you are determined to be successful at this. But with the seven, 14 right here, spirit is like, don't feel overwhelmed with the seven in reverse. Don't feel overwhelmed. Don't give up on your dream. Don't give up on this investment. Uh, I just feel like you just need to kind of like reevaluate, you know, um, um, because with this temperance energy, this 14 right here, this temperance energy, you're, you, I mean, just be patient. That's what I'm picking up on. Patience, okay? Very patient. Yeah. This money is coming in, baby. This stability is coming in with this magician energy here. The magician and this eight. This eight is, is all about balance, all right? Maybe you need to find some type of balance in a situation here. Um, you probably need to make an executive decision where it needs to kind of like change things up. And once you make that change, there go that nine. Once you make this change, um, it, everything is going to come to fruition. Okay. All right. Something's going to come to fruition for you guys, for sure. With this nine. Okay. Yeah. It's going to bring in, um, stability. It's going to bring in this, um, cause I feel like I said, some of you guys are just so determined, uh, to be successful here. And with this magician energy, this, this new opportunity, new beginning is coming. It's here. I feel like it's already here. I really do. I feel like it's here. Um, cause that eight also represents balance with your, um, material and spirituality. Right. Um, but something here is changing. There's some type of growth here that's coming. Um, you've worked your ass off. You work so hard for this to happen. Um, but spirit is like all your hard work and all the gratitude that you've been showing. It's about to come to fruition with this 10 right here. This is like a 10 of pentacles, 10 of cups. You're, that successful life that you are creating for yourself. It is absolutely in the ethers. It's just that you might not have it in the palm of your hand physically, my collective, but just a little more patience is going to bring everything to fruition. You probably just need to make some adjustments uh, to your plan. Okay. Um, yeah, cause this is a seven, an eight, a nine and a 10. Okay. This success is coming in, boo. This is success. This is prosperity. This is abundance. This is accomplishments. Um, whatever your gift is, this is like an eight of pentacles energy. I feel like you guys been working on this for a very long time. You know, that eight of pentacles represent mastering your skills. All right. And there's times where you, you know, you have to brush yourself off, get up, start it all over again. But even though you, you kind of were put on pause, my collective, it was to teach you a lesson. There was something here that you needed to learn. Okay. Um, but spirit says you prove to be resilient with that nine. I'm picking up like a nine of wands energy here, but all your, all your wish fulfillment is coming true. It's coming true. All right. This nine is representing of your fulfillment. Okay. You're about to attain the obsess, the, um, the success that you've been working so hard on. Okay. Um, I know some of y'all probably feel a little weary, feel a little tired, worn out, like, yo, when is this coming? But spirit says, this is all about to end. All right. Yeah. Yeah. This is all about to end. Look at all these nines. Look at all these nine, 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 nine. nine. It's so funny. Some of y'all might be seeing nine, nine, nine. Some of y'all might be seeing eights. All right. Um, yeah, look at this. This is, this is it. Look at that. This nine is also like the nine of wands, nine of pentacles. I feel like everything that you worked hard for, you had to, um, there were some lessons here and a lot of responsibility and getting it where you want it, where you want things to be. There's a lot of responsibility and there's a, and you need help. I feel like some of y'all is looking for partnerships. Um, you're looking for people who can help you to bring this to fruition, but whoever these people are that's coming in, is going to bring forth a powerful change, a powerful manifestation here. Okay. Absolutely. Because whatever you're doing for this work, whatever this master, this mastery that you're on, this skill, whatever this is, you are a healer. Okay. You are the real magician. You are the creator of your, of your, of, of your success of what you want. All right. But this is beautiful. My collective spirit is like, you're on the right path with this four. So don't, don't give up on that. Don't give up on that. Look at all these nines. Some of y'all might be seeing nine nines. All right. Cause I know I have. I've been seeing these nines sort of since yesterday. Nine, nine, nine. All right. Wish fulfillment, growth, abundance, creativity, security, independence. Um, but on this journey, my collective, like I said, you probably feel weary. 
you know, um, but you you show the you 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 you're very resilient. So spirit ain't gonna give you no. You know they say God don't give you more than what you can handle. You can handle this. You got this. All right. But on that journey as well, you've gained a lot of knowledge. You you've gained. You've learned how to do things better. Um, even if you were to fall short a little bit or be put be placed on pause, um, you never started back from ground zero. OK, you just learn how to do things more. Um, you learn to lessen in the journey going, going, going on, um, being on this journey. OK, so I feel like now it's going to bring in this abundance right here. It's going to bring you it's going to give you that life that you've been always wishing for. And it's going to bring you a lot of fulfillment and satisfaction. Um, and it's due to your own creativity and putting in this hard work and manifesting your stability. OK, and this work that you're doing, it is not just for you. Um, but you're going to use you, this gift, this talent that you have, that you're going to serve humanity with it. You're here as a healer and to serve others with it. Teach people. Uh, you know what I mean? Yeah. Some of y'all could be writing a book. Um, some of y'all probably get into like the health, health care or holistic is what I'm hearing. You guys might doing um, creating a holistic um, product here. It could be do, do dealing with something with skin care. Um, it could be dealing with something inside the body, you know, like a drink, a food. Um, um, some of you guys could be teaching people how to um, manifest money. Okay. Uh, yeah, something here in regards to something pertaining to that in the business and when it comes to business here in my collective. Okay, let's get the kipper on this. Yeah, unexpected income is here. Okay, I feel like you guys are going to get the investor that you're looking for. Yep, it's going to bring sudden wealth. Didn't I tell you? There it go. This unexpected income right here, somebody's going to help you. You're going to have somebody that's coming in. Um, this somebody is very, this person is like an investor. This person already is established. All right. Um, I feel like they're going to see the potential in your business idea here. Because the seven for me also represents like some type of contractual agreement here, some investments here. Um, but this unexpected income here, because I feel like you guys have been so weary. Like I was picking up on this nine right here. It's like a nine of wands energy. Um, but you're going to be so grateful. And I feel like because you have this spirit of gratitude, um, you've never given up. You've always found the courage to move, keep it pushing regardless. Um, Spirit is like somebody's coming in here to offer something here. This cycle is about to be over where you're going to be successful. And it's going to be some type of unexpected income here that's going to bring sudden wealth here. Okay. Yeah, that's what it's going to be. You're about to get a message from somebody. I don't know if you're about to get an email. I don't know if you guys were looking for investors or, you know, you put the word out there on the street, what you're looking for. Some of y'all could have attended seminars and did like networking and what whoever you sent. If you were in a networking in, uh, situation at work, when it comes to this eight of pentacles, like a networking group here, you're, you're about to get a message from someone. OK, somebody's going to come in and want to offer this um unexpected income to invest in your business idea okay could be a mature man this mature man for me is like the emperor somebody who's an authority figure somebody who's a boss somebody who's of wealth here all right yeah you about to get that yeah you about to get that gift baby look at that they're about to gift you okay they're about to gift you somebody wants to invest in you i feel like the concern is you guys you guys are feeling a little weary. That's, that's that concern. You know, probably looking for a business partner. But it's going to lead to a great courtship, that friendship. Here it is, four. this four. All right, you're on the right path, okay? Keep it pushing. That emperor, that four represents the emperor as well because the four in numerology represents the emperor, okay? So you got to, you going to get somebody here. There you go with that occupation. I can't make it up, my collective. I can't make it up. Look at that. Occupation is here. Mature man is here. All right. So you've been on this journey for a very long time. My collective with this 10, this struggle is about to be over. I feel like you guys are going to get the breakthrough that you've been looking for. All right. You're going to get a breakthrough. That's what I definitely pick up here. Definitely going to get that breakthrough for sure. Okay. This person is uh, a wealthy man. This is somebody who's very wealthy. All right. Somebody who is going to, um, that with this nine, I feel like with this nine, this person is going to see your business idea and want to invest. They're going to be an investor in this business. Okay. 
definitely want to invest with you. All right. Oh, wow. This is beautiful. I like this. I feel like the concerned person is you, my collective. Somebody here is worrying themselves, like, where am I going to get this money from? You know, you probably need some a bigger, you know, like a big investment here and thinking to get the business to the next level here. You've been working so hard at it, but you feel like you're not getting anywhere with this spirit. It's like, yeah, you are. You're about to get a message. Okay. Somebody's coming in with this chariot energy. Somebody's coming in because it's going to be unexpected, though. You feel me? Um, but this person who's coming in, they coming in with this ace of pentacles. They're very wealthy. All right. It could be a person. It could be an organization. It could be a company. You could have went to like a networking um, event, you know, um, where you network with people who is in the same um, career path or uh, entrepreneur uh, seminars or something like that with this aid, with this occupation here. Um but whatever it is, this is going to, this person is, they, they believe in your idea. This person absolutely believes in your idea here. And so, and this is somebody who's already established. Uh, the seven also represents, you know, uh, this person is uh, where their material and their domestic achievements have already been met. So they're coming in with this abundance to come invest in you. And you're going to be so grateful for this investment because you're not going to let this person down. I feel like you are about to, you're about to like roll up them sleeves for real and uh, prove to this person that they're not going to be wasting their time investing in you, this wealthy man. Cause I told you all of this is about to come to an end. I feel like some of y'all feel trapped. You feel stuck. Like, where is this going? Um, with that imprisonment card right here, my collective. Okay. Some of y'all feel like, but like with that 10 right here, I feel like this is about to be over. This wealthy person is coming in to help you and invest in this business. All right. Yeah. No more. You're about to get about this energy. Cause I feel like some of y'all probably try to, um, probably you guys hooked up with a lot of false people who told you they can help you to get this business off the ground or they talk a good talk, but they never brought anything to the table. You know, maybe they was trying to steal your idea, but even if they did try to steal your idea, my collective, they were never able to bring it to a finale. They could never make that change with it. You know why? Because it was never their idea. So these false people that you try to invest in, all right. Um, you try to work with these people before um, they try to steal your idea. But to see, this is an, this is something is of your gift. So these false people can never win. All right. Yeah, they, they will never win. No, nah, these people could be community. All right. These people probably stole your money in the past. Um, but see, you're about to get up out this poverty because it's see despair, despair, your stress. You know, they probably turned their back on you Um, didn't want to invest in you, didn't believe in you. You know what I'm saying? But it's okay. You learn from those lessons. You learn from those past mistakes. But those those past mistakes made you stronger, made you wiser. You know what I'm saying? Made you much wiser. So let's get the royal tarot here. I like this, though, my collective. I, I like that. I feel like you are so... Um, you're so courageous with that seven of wands energy. You, you just, you're determined. You're not giving up on this. Yeah. And Spirit says that's the truth. Justice is coming in for you, okay? Nine of cups energy. There it go. I said nine of wands, nine of cups. You're about to be so fulfilled. You're about to be so fucking satisfied with life. You're going to be so complete within you. You feel complete within yourself, but I feel like with this nine of cups energy, it's like your wish fulfillment is coming true. Like I said, you know what I'm saying? You're, you're getting your wishes to come true. All right. This is coming in the near distance horizons. And I feel like you've been waiting for a very long time. You've been waiting for your ships to come in with this three of wands energy, but it's coming in, honey. It's coming in. It is coming in. All right. All right, let's pull the um, tarot on this. Like this wealthy man, this mature man. He's very wealthy. You know, he probably... Um, probably a younger man, but he's very mature. He has an old soul. <laughs> this masculine got an old soul, okay? Yeah, this masculine got an old soul. Okay. All right. Let me shuffle this out. Seven of Cups, honey. I feel like you've been through so many options. You kind of weigh your options. And with the Seven of Cups, I feel like a lot of people came in with this illusion, those false people, you know, people who procrastinated, people who told you they can help you to bring your, your dreams to fruition, but it didn't really happen. So, you know, they had you jumping through hoops and doing the whole nine yard or um, the money was too much. It wasn't a, you couldn't afford it at the time or you, you know what I mean? So I feel like with that two of swords energy here, you felt blocked. 
you felt stuck. Um, you know, yeah, you kind of felt blocked. You felt stuck. But Spirit says, here, go to Wheel of Fortune. Wow. Look at that Wheel of Fortune. Things are changing. Okay? Fortune is in your hand. All right? Good karma is coming your way, my collective. Good karma because you worked your ass off. You know what I mean? You worked your behind off. You put the work in. All right? You, you've you been so resilient throughout the whole process here. This is coming in for you. Great fortune. Yeah, because you hold the strength. You have the strength here. You manifested this. All right? This is And this is coming in rapid, my collective. With this eight of wands, I feel like once that barrier is broken, once that barrier, you know you're waiting for that, just that one thing, that one thing, you're about to be unstoppable, baby. Look at you. Look at this magician. Look at you with your head down, creating. Look at you. Your head is down, like creating. And you see all them crystals on here or whatever it is you're doing here. You're manifesting your way in. You're, you're, you're tapping in and manifesting, tapping into your resources here. Like I said, spirit guides, you're asking God to show you. You're praying for this energy to come towards you. Well, it's coming. It's coming. It's coming, baby. And when it does come in, honey, it's coming in. And you're going to be unstoppable with that eight of wands. Yeah, baby, it's going to be it, you're going to be at the right place at the right time. OK, yeah. New beginning. So it's going to be a new beginning right here with this um, page of cups energy. OK, continue to follow your spirit, guys. Follow your intuition. All right. Because you're about to the page of cups also represents new beginnings. And that's going to lead you to this empress energy. OK. And for all those false people who didn't believe in you, it's going to shock the hell out of them. It's going to shock them. You and this person is going to be great business partners. I feel like with this emperor empress energy, you and this person is going to be great business partners for sure. Absolutely. You guys are going to make, it's like a, um, uh, a marriage, but a business marriage here. Okay. Yeah. Y'all going to be great investors together. You guys are going to make money together. Okay. Yep. There it go. I can't make it up. Great investors. They're going to seven of pentacles, my collective. There it go. There it go. You're going to get the good news that you want. Page of wands. And like I said, nine of cups, you're going to be so grateful for this opportunity because this is the one opportunity you was waiting for. I feel like with that page of pentacles, you've been mastering your skills for a very long time. All right. You've been on this mastery learning for a very long time, seeking the opportunity, been on this journey for a very long time. But with this wheel, with this eight, this eight is also the wheel of fortune. OK, things are about to change. All right. This is coming in the very near future. All right. You've been waiting for your ships to come in, honey. So I feel like with the eight of cups, people who walked away from you, turned their back on you, left you in this nine of swords energy to fend for yourself. Well, here it go, honey. You didn't stop looking towards the future. You didn't stop because you just, it's like you, you could see it. You could visualize it. When people didn't believe in you, you believed in you. And here it is. I can't make it up when I said the eight of pentacles, ace of pentacles. There it go. There it go, baby. This new money opportunity is coming in. But I said it's, it took slow and steady growth, slow and steady growth. Um, so some of y'all remember I said you might have to reevaluate. Um, you have to kind of do like do a lot, a little reevaluating when it comes to this, you know, rearranging things here. Well, guess what? Baby, it's yours, baby. That slow and steady growth, patience. It took patience. It took resilience. Uh, yeah, yeah. With this um, Eight of Wands energy, you you planted them seeds. When you was here manifesting in this magician energy, learning a lot, learning right here, you kept that inspiration. All right, you kept the vision because you you felt you kept that you you found ways to keep you inspired, right? With that page of wands energy, and that inspiration is what's bringing this new beginning for you now. All right, life is gonna change. Life is gonna be completely different. I feel like for some of you guys here, um, you're breaking that generational curse here, honey. You're gonna be the first uh, self-made entrepreneur, uh, millionaire in your family, my collective. There it go. Cycle is turning. Life is changing for you. It's going to be completely different for you. And it's going to get you out of this poverty. Okay. So some of y'all right here, you see that hand, that wealthy man, that's that wealthy man right here in this suit. Where is he? Where is that wealthy man? Somebody's coming in. They believe in your idea. So don't sit up anymore stressing. Nine of swords energy. No more worry. No more fear. I mean, it's going to be a sudden change in your life with that tower. And it's going to shock a lot of people who thought, who didn't believe in you. But you see that wealthy man? Ain't that the same blue suit in this picture? Giving in that hand? That wealthy man right there? Uh, this could be a married couple that wants to invest in you, my collective. All right? Mm-hmm. 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 This husband, this emperor, empress, this could be a great business partner uh, where you guys are coming in with to build this abundance. Um, with this emperor, didn't I pick up on that emperor energy when I seen that one magician energy? <clears throat> this right here, 
all this site this and this is ending ten of swords people who betrayed you people who told you that they can help you and had you all over the place um pouring into their cups basically with the seven of cups telling you selling you a dream basically they were selling you a dream all those people who betrayed you oh they're gonna be shocked with that tower card oh they're about to be shocked they're gonna wish they never went against you they're gonna wish this person is coming in to gift you either it's a couple these two could be a husband and wife coming in couple um that's that wants to invest in your business idea okay because maybe they are the owners of their business or you know something like that here but these two are coming in so no need to worry because that's that nine of swords energy that's that nine of swords that concern is that nine of swords got you up thinking like where am i going to get the money to invest this i need an investor how am i going to make this happen you know, but you're about to get that message, my collective. Yes, you are. Divine is sending this person. This is a divine meeting. This is faded. All right. So there's no need to worry, honey. That's about to be over, boo. That's about to be over. And didn't I tell you with that nine of wands energy, your resilience. Okay. You're resilient. Your, your, your resilience, your courage, your belief. You kept, you found ways to keep, to keep you inspired. You found ways to make you not give up on yourself and there go that six of wands all right now there go that success there go that success and that eight of wands honey and that magician energy honey it's gonna shock a lot of people because this about to this is about to be a transformation life is about to change with that death and that rebirth right here with this death card okay it's gonna, be, it's gonna shock a lot of people honey it's gonna shock them they're gonna wish they're gonna wish <laughs> All right, yeah. Nah, it's going to shock the hell out of them. Now they're going to wish that they could come through and, and, and feed off of you. But remember when I said like a seven right here feeling overwhelmed and no more need to feel overwhelmed because your wishes are coming true? You are going to be launching because you are determined to be successful. You are so determined. All right, yeah. This gift of yours that you've been working on, mastering, uh, like I said, with this Page of Pentacles energy, you've been on this journey for a very long time with this Page of Pentacles, uh, Page of Wands energy. You found that inspiration, okay? You didn't allow anyone to take you off your mastery. You didn't allow anyone. That strength, that resilience, that nine of wands. Yeah, you're, you, you, look, look, okay? These people are going to wish that they invested in you, but it's going to bring sudden wealth. And that is that eight of wands, unstoppable. You're going to keep it pushing, honey. You ain't looking back, all right? Because you work too hard to get to where you at, to give it out to people who do not believe in you. All right? Yeah, so... And because you've always been grateful for every for every step of the way, you've been so grateful. I feel like you've learned a lot as well on the journey. You learned, you mastered a lot of things. But I feel like every time you got put on pause or you were held up for a minute, um, spirit, you had to learn. It's like the lessons are in the journey. So in that, you learn how to manage your um, money more better. You learn how and where. It's like work smarter. Not saying you didn't work hard, but you learn to work smarter, right? Balance your energy, right? Right. So I like that, my collective. And for that, it's bringing in great fortune. It's bringing in abundance, okay? It's coming in, baby. Wish come true. A wish come true. This Seven of Cups is, oh, gosh, you're going to have so many people that's going to want to come in now and jump on this bandwagon now. Now they're going to want to jump on your bandwagon of success, okay? Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. Hey, look at that. You're about to be gifted, my collective. Very much so. Because you are gifted. All right. And that's what I have for you. I like this reading. Oh, this is about to be over. You're about to listen out for this message because you're about to get it. If you're sitting here in this concern, don't you worry. Spirit says, don't you worry. You're about to get the message that you want to hear. All right. You're about to get it. You're about to get it. And I feel like your spirit guys is telling you that too, my collective. Okay. Be easy. Be patient. Because this is coming in, honey. You're coming in. This, this chariot energy is somebody coming in. God is sending this person. Your angels are sending you to this person. You guys are going to be meeting up in the right place at the right time. Because this is destined. This is fate for when you meet this emperor and this empress. Okay. They could be a married couple. But messing with this wealthy man who's the emperor. Um, he's going to make you this so wealthy with that uh, empress energy, so abundant because you are abundant spiritually, but you just now trying to match it with your material wealth to go with that spiritual wealth. And it's about to come my collective. So I wish you guys uh, blessings and abundance. I like this. All right. I, I take this reading too. I take this reading too. I, I receive this energy. <laughs> it's your girl unknown goddess. I wish you guys love and light.